fun fact about cocoa apricot cream is that it always gives you a smooth top. Hi everybody, welcome to Kujo Scandals Co. My name is Marie. I want to take a moment to thank all my new subbies and my day one subbies. Thank you guys so much for being here and for subscribing. Don't forget to smash that like button so that we can help others who want to learn about cocoa apricot wax and perhaps those who are struggling to decide on which wax to use. So when I first began my candle business, I wasn't quite sure what kind of wax to use. Uh, as you will see in this video, I'll be using Cocoa Apricot Cream and later on I will tell you guys what I love about Cocoa Apricot Cream and a little bit of detail to help you guys decide if you want to uh, buy the Cocoa Apricot Cream or other waxes. I had already made a video about um, soy wax so make sure you check that video out so when i first began my business um i tried soy wax i tried paraffin wax i absolutely dislike paraffin wax uh, that's because it releases toxin in the air that i don't want me my friends and family and my customers to breathe so i decided to just go on to the natural route so that's when I began to um, experience soy wax. Now, while working with soy wax, it was nice, but it was also difficult because it always somehow ended up having uh, sinkholes or frosting and all those stuff that I just did not want to deal with. So I decided to try coconut alone. So I did coconut soy, I don't like it um, I did coconut I like the coconut because it's smooth and it's soft but when I heard about um, the new wax that just came out that was cocoa apricot cream I'm like holy cow let me give this a, uh, a try so uh, that's when I started to use coconut apricot uh, cream it was expensive, but um, I knew that investing in that uh, wax will be great for me so that I don't have to deal with other issues and it's very, very easy to work with. So um, yeah, that's when I started to buy uh, Coco Apricot. And it came to a time sometimes last year where Coco Apricot went out of stock everywhere. And that was a struggle for so many people who were using Coco Apricot Cream. And it was, it was basically, you're on your own, find another type of wax if you want. And, you know, but Coco Apricot is sold out. Um, so it was a wooden wick coal and they sold out um so i just found you know somebody who was selling it on um etsy and that's when i started to buy my cocoa apricot again so i was really really excited um but yeah anyways that's a brief story so i'm going to explain what i'm doing here and um, these candles that i'm making here of course i'm using my cocoa apricot cream guys don't forget to subscribe if you like it so far um, so I'm using my Coco Africa cream wax here. So I got these vessels from the dollar store. Uh, I was just walking around and wandering inside of the dollar store. And for some reason I was, um, looking for candle stuff or whatever. So I just, I just walked around there and then I saw these beautiful, cute little glasses sitting there with no lids or anything but you know what they are perfect because um the colors are beautiful and on the bottom it has a gold kind of uh, round circle thing there it's just really beautiful so i decided that i will use a dust cover for this and um yeah so the fragrance that i am using is a uh, black current absentee it's my favorite 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 uh, you guys know that so that's what my partner ended up choosing because he loves the smell too i have a small wick in those vessels because the diameter is two ounce 2.5 something like that so anyway guys i'm going to um go ahead and explain a bit about what I, why I love Coco Apricot Creme. So guys, don't forget to thumbs up this video if you like what I'm sharing with you. 
So let's talk about why I love Coco Apricot Creme so much. So as you already know, this wax is my favorite, favorite uh, wax out there. Coco Apricot uh, Wax is actually eco-friendly. It's a sustainable, uh, it comes from a sustainable ingredient. So it's a sustainable ingredient to farm. Um, Coco Apricot Wax burns um, slowly and it releases great fragrance. This means that uh, the ap Coco Apricot doesn't burn too fast. While other waxes burn too fast, you don't get it, you don't get to enjoy your money with like other waxes that burn too fast. But there is good news: you can always get your Coco Apricot Cram Candle from Kujo's Candles Co. When we relaunch in September 25th, our candle burn up to 80 plus hours. I feel so proud to even say that. <laughs> Okay, um, so let's move on. <laughs> Commercial candles often contain paraffin. We already know how I feel about paraffin. Paraffin enhances candle hot throw. The use of like paraffin emits unpleasant toxin in the air, which you really don't want to breathe. Because I made a video about uh, soy wax and paraffin in com uh, comparing both of them. So make sure you go and watch that video. It holds up from 10 to 12 percent of fragrance oil. Um, so although like Coco Africa Creme is a bit pricier than other um, waxes out there, but I promise you guys, it's definitely worth it. To conclude this, Coco Apricot is a toxin-free, eco-friendly, slow-burning. It has a great cold and hot throw so don't forget to get yourself some coco africa cream candle from kujo's candle skull when we relaunch in um, september 25th and it comes with a discount code i will announce that later thank you guys so much for hanging with me today and allowing me to express my love of coconut apricot with you and i will see you guys in my next video bye